Hey, hey, and this is Samina Lu here. And today I want to talk about why I dumped Facebook for YouTube. Now, this really concerns those of you out there who are using these various social media platforms for advertising your business or your businesses. And this is something that I was doing. <clears throat> I had chosen Facebook as my primary platform from which to advertise my business. So I had a network marketing business. I had e-commerce stores and of course I had to get the word out because as you all know, when you're working on social media, it's all about the traffic you get to your site. Without the traffic, you're not making any sales. And so I started using Facebook and a lot of people don't know that, I mean, because Facebook is a free platform, um, but once you start marketing, your product, you quickly realize that Facebook actually control how many people or how uh, the percentage of your friends who actually get to see your posts. So the only way to get your posts out to a hundred percent of your friends or to all the audience that you can afford for your post to go out to is by paying. So, so basically, if I want my post to go out to, let's say, 800 people, I would pay for that. And if I wanted my post to go out to 10,000 people, I would definitely pay a lot more than I would to 800 people and so on and so forth. And then again, they charge on a daily basis. So I would set my criteria to say $10 a day, $15 a day for a week or for three days, three days usually being the minimum. So this is how it was and mm, probably for the better part of a year, I spent a lot of money on Facebook and it was, I mean, it yielded results, but not to the extent to which I was spending the money. So yes, I was getting the traffic and yes, I was getting some sales, but I wasn't getting as much as I hoped for. So this went on for a while until one fine day I decided to, um, cause I also have a tutoring business. So one fine day I decided to market an affiliate program, a reading program to, um, like under four year olds. And I decided to market it on my Facebook uh, business page. And to my dismay, they banned it. And not only did they ban it, they actually nicely <laughs> said I could not continue operation on their, on their platform. So that came as a shock to me to find out that they're not really, they don't really, uh, um, you know, approve of marketing from marketing products from that particular, uh, I, I don't, you know, I, I really don't know what the, the exact problem is because the next issue with Facebook is it's hard to get hold of someone to talk to. So I sent several emails saying, okay, so what is the issue? What is the problem? I never really got anything back. From anybody just that well we've gone over this um, you know your your business how do they put it your business um, style or something like that and we can't continue business with you it was this just like that overnight so I moved my marketing to YouTube and I really wonder why I was on Facebook in the first place now I just use Facebook to I still use Facebook but I don't use it for uh, business advertising. I don't spend money on it. So I use it just the way you would use it, you know, just to, you know, put posts out there, uh, you know, interesting information and things like that. YouTube, on the other hand, also is a free platform, just like Facebook. But the neat thing about YouTube is they don't make a distinction between your personal posts or your, in this case, your personal videos and your uh, business related videos. Um, with Facebook, there was a clear distinction where once it's a business video or a, 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 a business post, in the case of Facebook, automatically to get the word out there, you had to pay the dollars. Um, I'm really enjoying YouTube. It's just all about just, just getting your word out there. Uh, SEO plays a large part in ensuring that your word, your message uh, via your video actually gets out there with YouTube. So 
um there are a few links i've left in the description box to let you know what kind of packages um several websites i'm using that help me with marketing on youtube and not so much marketing really just getting eyeballs on my video and it really is working i'm increasing in subscribers oh and don't forget to subscribe really there's a lot i have learned in two years on social media trying to build my business on social media and really that's what a lot of my videos are about just to let you know what i've tried and what's worked for me and maybe it could save you time in building your own business don't forget to like this video drop a comment and do not forget to subscribe i'll catch you on the next video